What is up everyone? So I wanted to go over some food groups that I think law students should probably avoid if you want to keep your mind alert and feel good for those long hours studying. And this is just something that I kind of came to uh, as, as far as the list goes as I was going through school, so I hope this helps. I cut out lactose. Now, I am lactose intolerant, but it sure did feel good to cut out the milk sugars. I just felt so much more clear. My sinuses felt clearer. I think a lot of my friends said the same thing when I told them about it. They said, wow, you know, I, I really feel like as if my nasal passages and breathing are just so strong now. They're just much more clean. There's you know fewer <laughs> phlegm moments and things like that. Uh, so in addition to the lactose, I found that cutting out anything that was high fructose corn syrup was really good. Um, the high fructose corn syrup is especially found in sodas where it becomes really easy to be like, oh, I'm going to have some diet soda and, you know, that'll be better. But it just really felt like a drag on my body. And I, you know, I, I cut it out and that was another thing that just helped me feel so much better. Um, I kept out the pig product just because uh, for me, it was just hard to get good, uh, healthy pig meat. And really, I, you know, I, I didn't want to have the more fatty cuts, and usually there's a lot of uh, fat with that. So I kind of avoid that as best I could. In addition to now the lactose, high fructose corn syrup, and I include corn syrup in that, and the pig meat, um, I also decided to really cut out most drinks that you could have, like sugar added drinks and like, you know, the, the gimmicky sugary stuff. I I wanted to just replace most of it with water. I'll have some almond milk here and there. I avoid the soy milk, but almond milk if I need it here and there, but mostly water. And being hydrated all the time, that really did a lot for me. I felt so much more refreshed every morning. I felt like as if, you know, my skin started to feel a lot smoother and cleaner. Uh, I just, I don't know, maybe you have the same experience if you try it, but you just start to get a sense that everything about you starts to clear up and clean up when you start to have lots of water and you, you know, especially replace that if you were having other things, you know, like sweetened teas and sweet and sugary drinks that may not be soda, but, you know, that really can, can, uh, can add on the uh, calories, especially when you're starting to get into the meat of, of your studies and you may not have as much time as you once did to hit the gym. So I hope that kind of helps, you know, just some things to consider cutting back on when you're studying because, you know, I know it can be tough when you're, especially when you're studying for finals and, and, and things like that to, to get back in that routine of uh, exercise and running stuff and stuff like that. So thanks everyone for listening and I'll talk to y'all later.